Barbara Streisand, 80, last week joined a number of celebrities who were publicly condemning the U.S. Supreme Court over its overruling of Roe v. Wade. The Supreme Court ruled there is no constitutional right to abortion in the United States as it overturned the Roe v. Wade case from nearly 50 years ago. In the final opinion, Supreme Court Justice Samuel Alito wrote that Roe and Planned Parenthood v. Casey, a 1992 ruling which reaffirmed the court's decision on Roe v. Wade, were unconstitutional. Reacting to the news last Friday in a social media post, Barbara branded the Supreme Court the American Taliban. In view of her 782,000 Twitter followers, Barbara wrote, the court uses religious dogma to overturn the constitutional right to abortion. This court is the American Taliban. Famous faces from across all industries have expressed their dismay over the overturning of Roe v. Wade. F1 driver Lewis Hamilton hit out at a U.S. judge in a furious statement following the decision. The Mercedes star said he had been left disgusted by last week's ruling. In an Instagram post shared on Friday, Lewis said, disgusted by the decision made by the Supreme Court in the U.S. today. I don't understand why some in power pushed and continue to push to strip rights away from millions of people. This decision will impact the most vulnerable among us. Women, people of color, members of the LGBTQIA community and so on. Singers Olivia Rodrigo and Lily Allen protested the decision during Olivia's Saturday set at Glastonbury. The driver's license hitmaker was joined by Lily Allen for a rendition of Lily's 2009 hit Fuck You. Prefacing the song, Olivia dedicated it to the U.S. Supreme Court as Lily walked on stage. Olivia said, I'm devastated and terrified, by the ruling, and so many women and girls are going to die because of this. And I wanted to dedicate this next song to the five members of the Supreme Court, who showed us at the end of the day they truly don't give a s about freedom. Olivia was not the only artist at the festival to hit out at the Supreme Court over the ruling. Singer Phoebe Bridgers led the crowd in chants of FK the Supreme Court on Friday. Meanwhile, during her headline set, Billie Eilish said, Today is a really dark day for women in the U.S. Before performing her song Your Power, she added, I'm just gonna say that because I can't bear to think about it any longer in this moment, 